latest Formula One news. Daniel Ricciardo's return to Formula One with AlphaTauri was interrupted by a hand injury he suffered at Zandvoort. He then missed the next five races. His strong showing at the Mexico City Grand Prix, where he qualified fourth and finished seventh, indicated a return to form or rebirth. Asked if the injury had in effect spoiled his return, Ricciardo said, Obviously, I wish this never happened, just because it was uncomfortable and painful and whatever. But now that is obviously done, I still look back on this year as a positive, because sitting here a year ago, I was like, could this be my last race? I don't exaggerate when I say that. I really don't know. I honestly thought it was 50-50. So to have a year I've had and forget the hand, I just feel a little bit maybe reborn again. Is kind of the right word. I feel just re-energised. I've obviously definitely got a second wind. If I then speak of the hand for this is not to feel like a setback, probably speaks volumes. I could see how maybe some people would see the, the lame accident with high consequences. Maybe Daniel should just give it up. That's probably just a sign that he should just call it a day. But I never thought that. I never felt like that. So yeah, that was maybe even more power to the decision of kind of trying to kick some butt. My enjoyment in a sport should not be results-based in terms of, yes, I know what's a good lap or what's a good race, and that will help me sleep at night, he said. It doesn't just need to be winning every time. I think I came to kind of places where I'm totally happy and comfortable at the time driving for the 10th place team on the grid, where last year when I said I don't want to jump back into the car, if it's fighting at the back, it didn't make sense for me. But slowly it started to make more and more sense. Ricciardo had justified his place in Formula 1. It reinforces the confidence Red Bull has shown in him. Red Bull's prerogative makes more sense than you think. His return to Formula 1 may divide opinion. Looking at purely at results, which is what F1 is all about in the end, the 32-year-old Australian who has shown flashes of brilliance hampered by a persistent lack of consistency from his improving Alpha Tori. But while extending his stay in Formula 1 may be influenced by several factors, Red Bull, by continuing to back a driver and giving him a second chance, has reeled their confidence in Daniel, not just through public support. Ricciardo's fourth place in uh, qualifying at Mexico shows what can he he do if he gets his act together. A consistent upward trend in performance would be assisted by a better car. In my best judgment, let's wait to see in three years' time whether Red Bull were justified in their confidence in Ricciardo. Thanks, legends, and I hope you're all well. Don't miss a moment from sports you follow. Please help us bring you the best content possible. Please share, like, subscribe, and vote in the community polls.